Please welcome Mr. Max Alexander, right here. Sit down, sit down, sit, sit. <laughs> How are you? Let me put this over here, you'll see me better. Oh, I love being here. This is great, the Sahara Hotel. It, uh, well, one little problem, the maids here have an attitude. Uh, this morning, the maid knocked on the door, said she has to come in and clean up. So I let her in, she took a shower and went home. It, uh... <laughs> and I am stuffed, I tell you. Yeah. I can't eat anymore. I don't care how cheap it is. <laughs> and what was it? Was it warm enough for you out here tonight? God. Oh. If you could live in Vegas, you might as well go to hell after you die. <laughs> I woke up this morning at 7.30. I had a buffet to go to. <laughs> you don't throw that coupon away, don't you? Huh? It was 104 degrees there, 7.30 in the morning. And you, you locals that live here, you're wonderful people. The best people live here, there. yeah. <laughs> But, when it comes to the weather, you don't, have a, you don't have a clue. You live in the middle of the desert. I go, it's 104 degrees, 7.30 in the morning. This is wrong. They go, yeah, but did you notice? No humidity? Mm, no. I noticed small farm animals exploding in front of me. <laughs> and I haven't had spit since Tuesday. <laughs> Nothing comes out. I'm like a cat with a hairball. <laughs> you go home, people, where were you? Vegas! You don't have spit, no! And I love this town, it's great. I uh, play the, little, the games. Uh, I don't gamble well. First machine today, I lost $134. Yeah, it was a candy machine. <laughs> I thought I had a system. Well, I tried. But, uh, this is just great being here. And Jerry was mentioning Canada. Yeah, welcome Canada. Canada is a great place. We should go to Canada. We forget it's a foreign country. Because they look like us, they sound like us. It's like America light. <laughs> I got my first speeding ticket up there. So you got to be careful because they have kilometers per hour, which is double miles per hour. No one told me that. I cross the border, I see sign speed limit, 110. <laughs> I'm cruising. I saw a sign, school zone, slow down to 60. <laughs> the least I could do. Very fast children. Canada's great. I'm doing so many things this year. It's been exciting. I'm trying to lose a little weight. Um, but it's not working. I love tea cookies, doctor says. Instead of cookies, why don't you try a rice cake instead? Ooh, yummy, yummy. Well, they're very good with fudge on them. Have you tried it that way? Oh. Excellent, excellent. And I tried everything. I tried the Valium diet. <laughs> You've been on that one. For breakfast, you take four Valium. The rest of the day, the food keeps falling out of your mouth. That's uh, yeah.
The worst one was the grapefruit diet. That one, the, that <laughs> grapefruit diet. After a week, I had 172 grapefruits. Every time I go to the bathroom, I'd squirt myself in the eye. It was most... <laughs> because I want to lose weight, I have to shop at the big and tall man shop, because I'm tall. <laughs> Salesman comes over to me and goes, you know, we have jogging suits in your size. I said, why? They, they have a, a cologne for the big man. It smells like a donut. <laughs> and as I'm leaving, I go to the checkout, they have edible panties. You see, it's edible panties in my size. On the box it says, there's a family of four. You've been terrific, thank you.